Good morning from a very sunny Norfolk. We have come to Sam's parents' cabin again for a few days just to get away and enjoy the fresh air and the countryside. And it is really beautiful sunny weather, which I think will only last until today. Then it's meant to be cloudy. So we are going to soak up the sun today. We are going to Wells next to the sea, which is just like a beautiful seaside town. We're gonna go for a walk on the beach. And then we may be walking some alpacas this afternoon. I feel like we should address something first, which is this beautiful scar on Sam's face. Actually, you can't really, oh, you can see a bit. Aww. It's not that bad, is it? No, it's, it's, it's healing good, actually. We're using bio oil on it. But basically, Sam, I don't like holding the camera like this because it makes me look weird. Not Sorry. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hi. Um, no, basically, Sam just had a little accident where he tripped over a bench and kind of smashed his forehead. Easily done. <laughs> and had to get stitches, but it's okay. He's fine. Chips at 12 p.m. Yeah. Uh, we will, we haven't had breakfast, but like, you know. What have you got? We have got. Well, I've got cotton chips. Ta -da! And look at the view. Fueled with some cake. It was delicious, wasn't it? Yeah, it was good. Coffee cake and Victoria sponge. We got some money out because the alpaca man only takes cash, obviously. Yeah. So we're on our way to the alpaca man to go and walk some alpacas. <laughs> this is so bizarre. <laughs> you excited? Yeah, I'm excited. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> He's just getting them ready for us. He's got 15 alpacas. Here you go. Oh. There you go. Oh, they, 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 they call you James. I know, it's but really it's filming. scary. I'll film you. <laughs> Sam, that one on the far right, I didn't feed him because he, he wouldn't take it and it scared me. Is that yummy? What happened? This one's, this one's up for He's it. had quite a few. You want one at the back, try and keep these guys in the middle happy first. <laughs> <laughs> that was the 
close <laughs> to something. But it's really good. Really yeah, we got a little key ring souvenir. I look a mess because my hair's all windswept. Um, but it's called alpaca trekking. So mine, he was called like Nacho, it. and yours was called Juanito. Juanito, that one. Which was the blonde one. And it was really fun actually. It wasn't it an experience. It's good, yeah. Yeah, it's called alpaca trekking. I will link it below. <laughs> <laughs> are about to cook our fave meal, which I've shown loads of times before. It's like that pasta with mince in like a creamy onion, delicious white wine sauce. So I'm tucking into a glass of wine. Did you burn your face? A little bit, yeah. It doesn't look too bad. It is a bit red. It's so windy, I didn't realize what it was. Oh, I feel like I've got windburn. I feel really hot flushed as well. Probably a bit of that as well, yeah. Yum! That's after the carnage. So last night we just got very full eating pasta bows and basically just chilled in front of the TV and now it is Friday and I have got a very horrible friend on my forehead which is not ideal. But we are about to go on like a two hour walk, is it like 7.5 miles or something? Yeah. Um, like a circular walk, we're going to just drive sort of 15 minutes away, park up and do a countryside walk. So I am, is it coastal as well? Um, I think part of it goes near the coast, but most of it isn't. Nice. It's a bit of a cloudy day, but it still should be nice to get some fresh air. And I am in my active wear. I'm wearing sweaty betty leggings, my neck trainers, which are really old, and this like old sweaty betty vest. Ready? Ready. Let's go. <laughs> just bought some local asparagus. It was very pricey. Four pounds too pricey, but... Like four pound fifty for some asparagus. It better be good. We're supporting the local growers. Um, and some potatoes for dinner tomorrow night because we're going to have some sausages. And you probably can't hear me because it's really windy. Goodbye. <laughs> finished it already. So we got pretty wet on that walk but have warmed up with some tea and scones which were delicious and now we are going out for dinner. We're really tired, we're like we're nearly falling asleep on the sofa watching The Greatest Showman. Um, but yeah, we're gonna go out for dinner in a really nice place and have a few drinks on this wild Friday night. Now we're gonna be late. Yep, okay. I have gone for a monkfish, but I'm a fork down, and you have got a very steamy looking curry. Good morning, it is Saturday, and we are walking to the gym. It's quite, what, what time is it? Um. We've had a bit of a slow morning, it's now 11.30, but we are going to go do a, a cheeky upper body session. And then, what else are we doing today? Yep, go to Byford's, which yeah. should be nice. And we are going to Mountain Warehouse, just to look for some tracking things for Sam. Just have a little browse. Yeah, Sam's going to, well, basically, he's not with me for the entirety of June, so that will be fun for me. <laughs> no, Sam's got loads of like, um, what do you call, well, you've got a couple of conferences, and then you've got, what's the Chamonix yeah, thing called? A of, it's a course, but it's it's also like, you know, trekking and stuff. <laughs> you know. <laughs> you know. It's, it's not very work heavy. <laughs> yeah. So it's quite a few things going on that he needs to get some equipment for and he's going to go out as well. But yeah, my arm hurts now so I'm going to go. I'm going to go now. <laughs> if you've watched Game of Thrones, then you know. But yeah, we'll try and film a bit in the gym and talk to you later. <laughs> Don't try and make y'all comfortable. That's right. For the record, you ain't trying to grow any stuff for you. That's right. For the record, lab on me going all the way. All the way. 
For the record, ain't tryna link no time to wait. For the record. Price on y'all, snake eyes on dice for y'all, shoulders on ice for y'all. A6 all the hay, I woke in a bar today, got lost in the ball and A's. I'm flipping the bars, I'm flipping the flipping the flipping the all record, all record. I still in the gym, and now we have some protein shake decisions. I didn't film very much in the gym. Well, you didn't film very much in the gym because we got some for like stories on, on the, my. On the gram, gram. I got it, yeah, on my phone portrait, so it's not suitable for the vlog, but. Protein shake. I think I'm gonna have strawberries and cream. Um, they've changed it. It's now 20 grams. So this one has 15 grams of protein. But I did manage to get some old ones, which are 30 grams, which have 20 grams of protein. Because I know that you like all the protein, Sam. Yeah. So I got these ones specifically for you. Do you want coconut? If you have it. The options for you are cookies and cream, coconut, or chocolate. Uh, yeah, coconut's good. Coconut. I'm gonna have strawberries and cream. They are very pale. <laughs> what have you got? Um, got carrot cake, uh, chocolate fridge cake, and cheesecake. Felt I'm done with the defense. Throw back and climb over your fence. Had to show, show you that I was a man. We have been chilling and I may have had a little cry because that film was quite sad. We just watched Woman in Gold with Ryan Reynolds and Helen Mirren and it was really, really good, wasn't it? Yeah, it was good. <laughs> Tonight on Cooking with Lottie, I'm drinking all the wine. Nearly spilled it, as always. <laughs> and Sam has gone for a swim and like a sauna in the like leisure centre here. Um, and I am cooking some chicken hex sausages, they're like smoky paprika ones. And I'm trying to figure out what the deal is, it's probably gonna see off the camera, what the deal is with this asparagus. We bought it local, it's in season, but they are bloody massive. So I'm trying to figure out what to do. I'm parboiling them, and then I'm going to pan fry them in some oil with some like salt and pepper. Got some parmesan to put on top. And I am doing some jacket potatoes in the oven, which Sam isn't very happy about because he wanted wedges, but they just can't be off. So we're having jacket potatoes in the microwave. I haven't even tested this wine yet. Oh, that's nice. Oh, it's an Argen Argentinian, Argentinian Malbec. It looks like these for winemakers. This one is very good. I put my hair in a plait when I washed it, so that's why it looks a bit crazy. It's probably still really wet in here. But, you know, I'm having a makeup free day and a bath's day. And I'm gonna go enjoy my wine and hope the dinner turns out okay. Cheers. We just finished, it's the next morning, because it's light outside, hello. And we finished watching this, quite a lazy morning. But it's actually quite good. I mean, I got confused because the whole time I thought that it was about the story of Lady Gaga, because I'm an idiot, and it was confusing. <laughs> I thought that was clear. <laughs> no, it was confusing. I thought it was a true story about her. That's why I was so confused. Yeah. But no, it was good. Bradley Cooper was good. Um, and now we're going to go to the gym before we head home. Yeah? Get some energy. Let's go. So you were shrugging your shoulders and closed off. That's what I told you. Soon enough, everything started to change. Cause there's no going back. No going back, there's no going back to your own life Not living in the past, we're over there I'm feeling it tonight, riding on the dizzying heights We are just cleaning up, getting ready to drive the long drive back to London. Have you had a good stay? It's been, it's been really good. Yeah, it's been really nice to switch off. I think four nights was perfect. Perfect. 
We came for three last time and we said we wish we'd come for four. I think four is perfect because you, yeah. you can just switch off for a couple of days. Exactly. Yeah, in case I didn't say, this is like Sam's parents' cabin. So it's quite nice to stay somewhere where we don't have to pay for it. <laughs> and we can just give it like a good clean afterwards. And we've written a little note in the guest book on the table so that people can see what we got up to. Right, I'm going to end the video here since we are just going to be driving home now and the vlog is already probably quite long. So thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Hit the subscribe button for loads more content and I will see you in the next one.